Today we'll be solving lead code 64 minimum path sum. We begin by finding the size of the grid. Next we handle the first row. Since the only way to move in the first row is from left to right, each cell in this row can only be reached by the one directly before it. To update this, we loop through every column starting at 1, and for each position, we add the value of the cell directly to its left. By the end of this loop, the first row represents the minimum path sums if we only move right from the start. Then we move on to the first column. Here the only way to move is straight down from the top. So we loop through every row starting at 1, and for each position we add the value of the cell directly above it. Once this is complete, the first column represents the minimum path sums if we only move down from the start. Now we focus on the rest of the grid. For every cell that is not in the first row or the first column, there are two possible ways to reach it, from above or from the left. We choose a smaller of these two paths and add the current cell's value to it. This ensures that each cell stores the smallest possible sum to reach that point. We do this using a nested loop that goes through each row and each column, updating the values as we go. Finally, after filling in the entire grid, the bottom right cell contains the minimum path sum to reach the destination. That's the value we return as our answer.